in regions that had unfrozen stadium. I think that after, you know, in the post-corona world, the post-slippy world, we probably won't see that. I mean, everybody's here now. Everybody's used mm -hmm. to it. Are we and really I'm going FD it. to start it off? Yeah, Harry loves... Yeah. Oh, wait, this is Velo's B on this one. Well, we'll see. Maybe he knows something. I don't know. Maybe Harry, maybe Harry has the worst chain grabs of all time. They're looking pretty good now. Yeah, it looks like it. Look like it. <laughs> they look pretty good. They look fine to me. Look, he dropped one. And this is something that we saw um, in our... So these guys have played two times before today. Right. Um, and one thing that popped up was that... Oh, my God, bomb. That was a bomb, yeah. <laughs> <Hang on>. <laughs> <laughs> Harry one throws thing that popped up... Is that uh, Bello really likes the extra space to shoot to run around and shoot lasers with? Mm -hmm. Although it's, he's not, he doesn't always use it. Sometimes he just runs in and tries to hit Peach. But he does like to switch back and forth. Oh wow! Okay, and he also likes to, to reduce blast zone. Yeah, like right there. But Bello likes to be able to switch back and forth between approaching and shooting lasers. Yeah, I mean, he should every, match up. definitely. Like everything about the stage is great for Fox. The only thing is that he gets hit hard in terms of him hitting and neutral he's totally gucci and so if he's mm -hmm. feeling confident, so of course they've seen yeah they've seen boxes like um s bad go to fd as a counter pick against marsh yeah i mean it's definitely weird but here so we goes, are if you're confident enough that you just won't get grabbed then it's all in your favor right yeah and you know, sometimes people just feel comfortable here. They might know, yeah, I might get chain grabbed a couple times, but you know, this is just my comfort zone. It's my happy place. Oh, and after all that practice and all that flexing, <laughs> where did it get him? Yeah, trying to get a whip punish there with the up smash. It's tough on Peach. Weird character to whip punish. Definitely. Ooh, should have just Ooh, rolled yeah. up there. Bellow's slipping. He's kind of calling everything out and not quite capitalizing on it. There it is. Oh, well, he calls out that uh, that jump right there. Yeah, and then almost nares directly into the blast zone. <laughs> He's back, though, and this is pretty easy. And yeah, the chain grabs haven't hurt that bad. Yeah, oh. the back air there. Ill advised. Yeah, <laughs> yeah uh, Harry is a known down smasher. Yeah, both. So you really don't want to give him a chance. Yeah, and imagine oh, really being a known down, down smasher. <laughs> <laughs> Up tilts that turn. If there's the drill, that's what you need. But it's tough. Drill, I don't know, something about it. Feels a little harder to L cancel than there, at least to me. And there it is again. Is he going to finish him off this? Ooh, yep. interesting finish. Calling the double yeah, jump in the key. late way. I think he fooled all of us. That Definitely. was pretty cool. I saw that on the Twitch replay. Seems like he knew what he was doing. So. Lost on FD. He could go back. Maybe he's... Because, you know, as we said, the chain grabs, it's not really like that's exactly what won it for him. Maybe mm -hmm. he'll go back. Yeah, the chain grabs only happened twice, and they weren't really for that much percent. Yeah. Um... Well, I maybe feel like Velo, really it. Velo's gonna pick Dreamland, and then Harry's counter picks are gonna be Stadium and Yoshi's or something stupid. Oh, ooh, he sees uh -oh. the Stadium pick, and he says Ice Climbers. Interesting. This stage is definitely good for Ices, especially Frozen, game changer for them, because it's basically just FD with uh, with two little two little boots on the side. Mm -hmm. It is important to note that uh, wobbling is indeed banned in this tournament. Yeah. Harry has shown in this bracket, though, that he doesn't need it. Mm -hmm. He's got some handoffs. He's got some, you know, forward smash. He's got a crash cancel down smash. Yeah. Oh, yeah. All of his characters can do that. <laughs> oh, late. Okay, gets the roll. Late on the punish. And then no DI. Okay, oh, no, Nana. No, it's not timers, but drops it. Nana's get up attack. Smart move by Nana there. And the blizzard. That always hurts. Blizzard, a rough move to deal with. Oh, Nana. Nana's the MVP right now. <laughs> Nana's won neutral two times. Yeah. And yeah, Nana's literally done all the work. <laughs> 
just waiting by the ledge. Harry not trying to overextend towards it. I like that because last stop got beamed a couple times there. The cheeky oh, down. Those doing some really good stuff. Those doing some really good stuff when it comes to separating the edge climbers. Um, he's kind of just down airing, like back airing directly on top of them and getting down smashed. Yeah, he just needs to clean like, up. It's man. All right. Grabbing and throwing mana, that's always a bit risky. He makes it work though. Dash attack re grab. Goes for it again. Goes for it again. The classic. And here we go. Oh, playing the ground game. I'm surprised. Oh! There we go. I, You know, I'm expecting Velo to take to the skies here, but full hop game against Popo, pretty strong. Doesn't need it, though. Um, dash dance grab game against Popo, also very strong. Very true. But you never know. That wave dash down smash uh, asterisk teleports behind you could come in at any moment. <laughs> and there it is. Harry's so cheeky with the smash attack. <laughs> he really is very cheeky. Yeah. Nice uh, little bit of SDI, ASDI there. Probably got him out. Oh, and the up tilt call out? And the icebergs. Oh, here he catches his jump. On and out. Mana getting into the action. Okay, got him in the air. Killing okay. Mana off the top. You don't see that too much. Wanted that there. He's in a good spot, yeah, though. Villa's gotten, Villa's gotten a little bit uh, over-eager with his up-smashes on occasion. Yeah, he gets antsy, and there's another cheeky forward smash. And no DI on that, really? That hurts. <laughs> that really hurts. Now, spider Jew looking like he's in a real comfy spot. 2% for his troubles. It looks like... Oh, nice on oh, nice Yeah, nice And the, the cheeks. The cheeks. All the extra percent is just cheeky damage. And Velo's looking a little tilted. I'm not gonna lie to you. I'm not gonna. I don't say that often. I'm not gonna lie to you. <laughs> but he's looking a little uncomfortable. This character really brings it out of you. The ice climbers. Are... It really does. Yeah. <gasps> oh no. The blizzard. Oh, this guy is the blizzard. For the and what is he? He's still going. For those of you that may not know, that sort of blizzard oh, is, is not common. This could be it. Is he gonna clutch it? Oh, he's back. Spider Dude. Spider Dude's playing real careful, staying right in that. Oh point. my god, what are you doing? What was that? I don't know if that was genius or. <laughs> and he wasn't able to put that mana there. He had everything in front of him. Oh, I, oh, I, I, I did not know right. if he was going to. I didn't know yeah, if he was going to. Spider Dude knew, had the right play, the regular, or the get up attack. Mm hmm. Is that 2-0? Two, two, oh. two, yep. He's going for the 3-0-3-0. Three, oh, three, oh. Even though it was, what was it, 2-1 the other games? But still. He's trying to close out the 3-0 oh with a 3-0. Oh. So do you think we're going to see uh, any character swaps from either side? I don't know about Velo's kit, but spider Jew definitely, I have no clue who he's playing now. It must depend on the <laughs> stage. Yeah. Like, I feel like if we go Pokemon again, then... Spider-G is probably going to stay Icy's. It's like we are heading to Battlefield. She I mean, my, my, <laughs> I, I, I feel like he should go Peach, because that last game was so close. Mm -hmm. The first game with Peach was more decisive, but that was also on FD, but that was also Velo's pick. So it's, yeah. all, messy. it's yeah. all messy. I don't know who he's going to go. Okay, uh, place your bets. It's not a character we've seen before. Cheek. Oh my god. No, he's not we've a... seen Cheek before. Oh, wait, you mean it's not a character we've seen today at all? Yeah. And we're going Battlefield? Oh, Go okay. Battlefield. Um, oh, I don't, I mean, what, Puff? Ganon? Dr. Go ahead Mario. And guess in chat, too. Dr. Mario. <laughs> what do Spider Jew's characters all like doing? Nathan's pick is looking good right about now. <laughs> I'll, I'll, I'll just say regular Mario then. I'll just take regular Mario. <laughs> All right, so your votes, Mario. What was yours, uh, Doctor Mario? Man? All right, neither of those are correct. Who else down smashes? Also, Spider Jew, you're you're good to oh, go. Oh, Samus? Is it Samus? There you go. God, oh <laughs> my, all right, all right. Here we go. Spider Jew, Samus. I never seen this. He likes to hold down and he likes to flick down on the yellow stick you're too. Right. So much better than the Mario's at that even. Ready, go. Oh my god. 
Spider Juice <laughs> Samus. The purple Samus. I super like wave dashes. Instant super wave dash. How many characters does this guy have in the book bag? Now, there aren't really any Samuses in Oregon. What? Um. <laughs> well, we've had some. There's Q wins. Yeah, but and... none that Villa would have played, I think. Yeah. Perhaps, oh, we had we had Tio Lanehole for a little bit, but he switched to Sheik and he right. also moved away. Yeah, Ooh, wrong direction on that up I, I, I did he swat? Did he give somebody else the controller? This Samus is looking very competent. <laughs> <laughs> he's, he's behind, but just the way that he's playing, it does not look like this was some kind of weird gimmicky desperation pick. He looks like this is a low mid level Samus main who's been rocking it for years. Yeah, it's in Spider Samus. Yeah, Spider Samus. He's moving on the platforms, he's shooting this one. Spamus. back airs. Spamus? Oh. That would fit his place up. Surprisingly. These though, super we... wave dashes, oh my goodness. Yeah, he's just popping them out. Reverse F smash. And now he has the charge shot. This is a momentum shift for Samus. When's he gonna pop it out? Velo missing a jump cancel there. Yeah, he's just doing whatever he wants. He's in training mode right now. I'm what are you doing? He's not Velo... even firing the shot. Do you think Velo is oh like confident in comboing Samus? I don't think so. Yeah, she I think be very... weird, right? Is there any fun? I think this is actually an amazing <laughs> counter pick. This is surprising to say the least. Now I'm getting scared because I'm like, am I going to have to play the Samus? <laughs> <laughs> but it looks like the main thing that you have to watch for is the super wave dash full screen yeah. approach. So <laughs> There you go. Runs to the corner, drops the bomb. You already know what's coming next. Good ledge dash, though. Yeah, we really haven't even seen that many down smashes, though. Yeah, well, he's a super wave dash based player. Yeah. Hold oh down, man, Samus. that hits from there? This is... This is crazy, because you gotta remember, Velo is the player who just knocked out Dr. Z. Yeah. And they're now getting Although, styled on with Super oh, Wave Dash, oh, Samus, yeah. and charge it's, shots. Like, Basically a 50-50 right there. That was crazy the way he boiled that down. Oh, and oh I, you saw the first couple frames of a taunt come out mm -hmm. from Spider-Dude. <laughs>